it says here in this book, the average unmarried female, basically insecure due to some long frustration, may react, react, with psychosomatic symptoms, difficult to endure, affecting the upper respiratory tract. In other words, just from waiting around for that plain little band of gold, a person can develop a cold heart. You can spray it wherever you figure the strep to cock lurk. You can give her a shot for whatever she's got, but it just won't work. If she's tired of getting the fish eye from the hotel clerk, a person can develop a cold. It says here, the female remaining single, just in a legal sense, shows an erotic tendency. See, note, 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 chronic organic syndromes, toxic or hypertense, affecting the eyes, the ears, the nose, and throat. Ha! In other words, just from wondering whether the wedding is on or off, a person can develop a cough. You can feed her all day with the vitamin A and the bromo fizz, but the medicine never gets anywhere near where the trouble is. If she's getting a kind of a name for herself, then the name ain't his. A person can develop the grip. And furthermore, just from storing and storing and storing the wedding trip, a person can develop the grip. When they get on the train to Niagara and she can hear church bells chime, the compartment is air conditioned and the mood sublime. Then they Saratoga for the 14th time, a person can develop the grip, the grip, the post nasal drip with the wheezing and the sneezing and the sinus that's really a pip from a lack of community property and a feeling she's getting too old. A person can develop a bad.